Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Camel Guys Detail Garage. Today, I will be going over all the different types of wheel cleaners we offer. Why? Because every car has different types of wheels. By that, I mean some cars have matte wheels, chrome, aluminum, powder coated or anodized or any other wheel finishes. So in this video, I will be going over every single wheel cleaner so you can find out which one's the best one for you. Let's get started. So as you guys can see, I have my wheel cleaners laid out from Diablo Gel all the way to Orange to Greaser. Why? Because Diablo Gel is going to be the safest and Orange to Greaser is going to be for the heaviest grind. But let's begin with Diablo Wheel Gel. Diablo Wheel Gel is actually very concentrated and it has to be diluted. Whether you dilute it into a bucket method system or in a secondary sprayer bottle. So Diablo Wheel Gel works on all types of wheels. Matte, aluminum, chrome, etc. Right? So Diablo Wheel Gel, whenever you dilute into a secondary spray bottle and you spray it onto the surface, it's actually going to foam it up. We recommend diluting Diablo Wheel Gel in a ducky spray bottle. You'll see it right here. Beep! But whenever you dilute into a secondary spray bottle, you spray it onto the surface. Like I said, it's going to foam up. It's going to go and cling onto the, all the dirt, grime, debris, brake dust, and it's going to go ahead and help you remove as safely as possible whenever you're using quality brushes. Whenever you have a ceramic coating on your wheels and you do not want to harm it, I recommend going with Diablo Wheel Gel. It's going to be the safest wheel cleaner we offer to remove any brake dust, grime, debris from any types of wheel. So now we're going to be moving on to Sticky Citrus Wheel Gel. This is a step higher than Diablo Gel. So Sticky Citrus Wheel Gel is a citrus based product that still works on all types of wheels, but then this is for a step higher if you have heavier brake dust, grime, debris that are sitting on your wheels, calipers, rotors, or even suspension work. Whenever you spray it on there, Sticky Citrus Wheel Gel is going to cling onto the surface and not run off. It's going to penetrate it, so whenever you come with your quality brushes and you scrub it down, it's going to make wheel cleaning a lot much easier. If you have heavier grime, debris, and you do not wash your wheels, as frequently as possible, then we recommend moving it up to Signature Series Wheel Cleaner. Signature Series Wheel Cleaner is also a citrus based product, but is highly concentrated. We recommend diluting it 4 to 1 whenever using on any types of wheels, but do not use this on matte wheels. Unfortunately, it is too harsh and this will add some type of shine to your wheels, so do not use it on matte wheels. So, Signature Series Wheel Cleaner works amazing on heavy grime and fill. It's still safe for all types of wheels except matte. It's going to penetrate the dirt grime, pull it off easier. This is a perfect product to use whenever your wheels do not get clean as frequently as possible. Signature Siri is going to penetrate the grime and remove it safely and easily as possible. Just a couple sprays onto the tire and wheels, scrub it down, rinse it off, and you're good to go. So if you wanna take your wheel cleaning even to the next level and you're that person that has heavy amounts of brake dust, like for example, you wash your car today, two days after driving it, you have heavy amount of brake dust, that's when I recommend using Decon. So Decon iron remover is not safe for all types of wheels. We do not recommend using it on matte wheels. So Decon iron remover actually decontaminates the surface of the wheel. By that, whenever you spray it onto the surface, you might see a chemical reaction. That chemical reaction is actually gonna be purple. That means it is decontaminating the surface of the wheel. But if Decon does not turn purple on you, that does not mean it's not working. It is still working, but all that means is your face of your wheel does not have so many iron particles. We recommend spraying onto the surface, letting it dwell on your face of your wheel for three to five minutes. Decon can also be used on painted surfaces to decontaminate. But whenever you're cleaning any type of wheel, we always recommend cleaning it while it's cool. Do not clean it once you just finish driving it. If you just finish driving it, we recommend parking your car, letting it sit for an hour or so, and then you go ahead and clean up your wheels. So now we're gonna be moving on to orange degreaser. So a degreaser can also be used to clean your wheels such as orange degreaser, but whenever using orange degreaser, we recommend diluting it. Never use it full strength on any type of wheel. If you want heavy duty cleaning, we recommend diluting it six parts water to one part chemical. If you want medium duty cleaning, we recommend diluting it 10 to 15 parts water to one part orange degreaser. And for light duty cleaning, we recommend diluting it 25 to 40 parts water to one part chemical. That is right, orange to greaser is highly concentrated and must be diluted. If you're not a person that knows how to dilute or is good at diluting, we recommend staying on the left side, which is sticky citrus or Diablo wheel gel. If you do know what type of wheels you have and they are not matte, we recommend using this side over here. So guys, if you guys like this video, don't forget, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below, let us know what type of videos you wanna see, and we'll see you guys next time right here at the Chemical Guys detail garage.